Um, I'm Jimmy. And I'm Mark. And I'm Jordan. Okay. Don't you just love those nice Saturday mornings when you hit like all work all week and uh, you sleep until like noon, right? You wake up, you walk upstairs if you sleep in the basement or downstairs or wherever you sleep, right? And uh, what's the first thing that hits your nose while you're walking out the kitchen? Muffins. <laughs> That's right. Uh, warm, soft, sweet delectable muffins that your mom just made you. You don't have to settle for cold cereal anymore. You got muffins, right? But wait, these aren't just any muffins. <coughs> no, we blended your favorite M&M candy with delicious Betty Crocker muffins to make you a col colorful, melt-in-your-mouth delicacy. Now you can enjoy these warm, colorful, melted chocolate muffins like every day is that Saturday. Alright, so we originally made our muffins with cake batter, which did not taste good that well. Not at all, actually. So then we just got Betty Crocker's muffin mix and mixed it with our M&M's and we got fireworks on top. It was amazing. It was great. Okay, so um, we call them rainbow muffins because of the color change. Like when we put them in the oven, the M&M's like, make it change color. So that's why it, it like differentiates from other types of muffins. It's colorful and it has your favorite candy in it. And um, our target market is going to be like adults and grandparents with like children and grandchildren. Because, um, you know, like all kids love candy. Or, like most kids love candy. So um, there's no reason why anyone wouldn't love these. Alright, so we were going to start our, uh, we're going to present this and like start in California area. So like there's three like little suburban areas that we were going to introduce it to, which was Linwood, Baldwin Park, and Cerritos, California. And then we were also going to introduce it into a bigger city with more populous, which is Los Angeles. And there's all grocery stores and like local convenience stores in the suburban areas, and then there's big time big stores with Los Angeles, like Walmart and Chinooks and stuff. Alright, the packaging, our, our product, Rainbow Muffins, consists of a collaboration between Betty Crocker and M&M's, of course. Uh, we used a picture of the actual finished product to give our customers a delicious idea of what they'll be making and or consuming when they purchase the Rainbow Muffins. Uh, we also added the company logos like the M&M's Man and the Betty Crocker uh, trademark spoon. Be because like branding, like to the customers, branding is a big aspect. Like subconsciously, if they see those two, like you said, with uh, with a brand, it's like a promise of quality. So they'll know that they get the quality of both of those companies. And another big thing is like the colors of the box, like red, the Betty Crocker red. And then if you think about it, like the muffins are kind of yellow, and so is the M and M man, and like. Red is like a hunger color, right? And then it, yellow is like means speed, like with McDonald's. Except it won't be like speed of how fast you make the muffins. It'll be like speed of how fast they're gonna be gone, you know? Because people are gonna like them so much. Um, and their pricing, they're gonna be about four fifty a box. Um, we like compared it to our competitors, and we just added a dollar for the M and M's. Competitors, uh, naturally you'd think like a company like Pillsbury would be a competitor, but they're not because they're both owned by the same company, General Mills. And basically the only competitors we would have would be like those top five large uh, food companies like Pepsi, Dole, General Mills were the third, then Nestle, and then Kraft. So like those companies, like Pepsi, they make Pepsi and other soft drinks, but they also like make chips and whatnot. And who knows, they might make something like what our product offers. So just like Nike, they have soccer shoes and like football gear and all other stuff to cater to everybody's any sports needs. These companies have things like that too. So that's the only real threat that we have. And 
any other competitors that we would have would be like uh, local like bakeries and whatnot that might adopt our idea. So those would be our only competitors. Okay, so next time you're hungry for a tasty treat, you can grab a bag of M&M's or a regular old muffin, or you can try a rainbow muffin and have double the satisfaction. Good job, guys. Okay, here's what I like to do. Um, grab a sample. You keep your product tester sheet. You need to bring that back to class with you tomorrow. Hey, great job today. I saw some really awesome things, and I saw some things we definitely want to get better at. This is going to be a great learning experience.